Well, if you want to get the maximum FPS possible in your low-end device, then make sure you watch this video until the end. Oh, the FPS you're looking at is just an illusion, don't believe it. See you after the intro. And how careless we could be. So here we back guys, I will show you some tweaks you should use to boost your FPS. First of all, you will click on the Windows search and type edit power plan. And it will be show up like this with the battery sign with a plug in and click to open it. A window will show up like this and from here you have to click on power option. Basically windows will put on balance mode or power saver mode. So you have to put it to high performance. That will give you your GPU and CPU extra power to generate more graphics. And if you don't have high performance setting, then you can create your own power plan from the left menu. Just click on create a power plan and from here put it on high performance and name it whatever you want. For example, I give it gaming. Then click on next and create it. And here we go, you have your own power plan setting. In next, on the desktop, press Control shift and escape it will open up task manager and from here you have to click on startup apps and it will show up some software which is running background whenever you open your pc so right click and disable all of them one by one and it will save your pc's ram in next click on the windows search and type graphics setting and open the first one you see so it will be show up like this from here you have to search fortnite and click on option and put it on high performance it will prioritize your gpu to run fortnite in full power and if you don't see fortnite in the list then you have to add it manually so what you have to do scroll up click on the browse and find your fortnite folder and from here go to fortnite games and then from here binaries and windows 64 and from here you have to choose fortnite client windows 64 shipping the first one i selected and add it on the list so here on the screen you can see the default location of fortnite installation folder now we have to reset fortnite graphics setting for that you have to open run.exe you can also press windows r from here type percent user profile percent and press ok so it will take you to a folder like this and from here you have to open app data and if you don't see app data on the list then you have to click on windows search and type file explorer option or folder option and open this it will pop up a small window like this and from here click on the view and check on the show hidden file folders and drive click ok now you will be able to see the app data folder and open it then go to local from there scroll down search fortnite games and click on it hold shift and delete at a time and enter now we successfully reset fortnite catches and settings now we will do one of the most important tweak for your fps boost so open your epic game launcher and from here click on your profile and below there click on settings and scroll all the way down find fortnite click on it and click on add additional command line argument and type the exact code which is showing on the screen feature level es31 click outside the box and exit the setting it will put your game in performance mode by default now click on the library and find here fortnite click on the three dots and click on options from here uncheck high resolution texture and apply it it will reduce your game size now minimize your epic game launcher and click on windows search and from here type temp from the below list click on delete temporary files it will show up a windows like this and from here click on temporary files and make sure that the download is unchecked and click on remove files it will clear up all the junk files in your pc and make it more faster now open the file explorer from the left list right click on this pc or whatever you named it click on properties and go to the advanced system setting the window will pop up like this then click on setting and put it on adjust for best performance and press ok this will slightly increase your pc's response time now press windows r and type percent temp percent and enter it will show up a folder like this and from here click on the first one and scroll all the way down hold shift and press the bottom one 
it will select all of them press shift delete and enter so it will clear up the junk file which is created by the software or games now go back to your epic games and launch fortnite your game will open like you have downloaded it right now and don't worry you just have to open your game and follow all the steps i do and even you will feel that your game is slightly faster than before skip everything and go to your settings and copy everything what i do put the window mode to full screen and put the resolution to the lowest and the frame rate limit to 60 and you will see the render mode is already in performance nothing to worry about it just scroll down and uncheck auto download high resolution textures show fps put it on and i will recommend you to reduce your 3d resolution to 70 or 75 percent then if you see any stability in your fps then you can increase it more higher but i will prefer 75 percent that's it and put it on apply and now hop into a game or go to battle lab to check your fps i hope your fps is way better than before hopefully everything should be smoother than before and if you see 60 fps stable then make then make it unlimited so check it and how much fps you get anyway don't compare with my one because i have a very high end pc so it will does not match with your one and i make this video for the low end pc gamer because i also struggle with low fps in my pc before and another important information for you that always make sure your gpu is up to date and your windows is also up to date that actually have a huge impact on your game so I hope you have understand my voice clearly and hopefully your FPS will boost a little bit. Let me know in the comment section does it work or not. If it work make sure you subscribe my channel and of course if you love game and if you are a gamer then make sure you join my discord server. The link is in the comment section or otherwise check in, in the description. So that's it if you have any question or problem related to your game then make sure you write it in the comment section so that I can make another video for your problem. And thank you so much for watching my videos and I hope you will share this video to your friends who are having trouble with their FPS. Anyway, keep watching my video, keep supporting me, use my code daredark-youtube in your Fortnite item shop or in Epic Games before you purchase anything and I will be very happy if you use my code. So thank you so much for watching until the end. See you soon in the next video. Goodbye.